Ooh, testing. I bet my voice is really coded and really sexy. Why you change your voice like that? <laughs> because, no, listen, listen, listen. I'm sure it sounds much better than that. I want to thank you for coming to my channel. Today I have a very unspecial guest, Jeremy. But I'm so happy you're here, like my first real guest. In the yo. How does it feel? <laughs> In the yo, nobody says that. Not, what do they say now? Not the yo. We not in Rosemont anymore, man. Stop. You, you moved up. <laughs> I'm in an undisclosed location. You're my first. You're my first visitor. Cause you live in Timbuktu. Who's coming out? Who coming out this bar? Nobody. Nobody. And that's the beauty of it. If you don't want any type of like visitors, family members, home invasions, you gotta move out. Now you get home invasions. Well, you you live you live around like people campsite. That's how far you live. You live so far. In the boonies, that only people that are around are people who have like RVs and campers who stay overnight. So those people will actually invade your home quicker because they're not from here. I not, believe not it. to scare you. I'm not scared. We already, I already had my car broken into. I just didn't tell you because I did not want to hear the jokes. Oh, let me move my f***ing car. No, I left it outside. They broke into Trey's car, got his tools, and tried to steal my Kia. Imagine how pissed I was. <laughs> I'm like y'all gonna just y'all already in his car. Take his car. Yeah, that's that's love. Why you why you want, why you want somebody to steal your husband's car? I don't know. It, it was five hundred dollars. It hit harder. Like my 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 car legit was out of commission for three weeks. Why? They broke. They tore my ignition. They used his like screwdriver, <laughs> and they tore my ignition. I legit couldn't drive it. That's ingenuity, man. That's that's good. That's I like the, I like I like how they think though. They try. It's somebody who lives here though. How you know? Because. I'm like in that whole Facebook town group. You got all this technology. Keep people out of my game room, please. All they can see right now is a mic and a plant. Keep people out of my game room. Yeah, nobody says this stuff. It's like you, it's like you like using like old like slang. Like you, you Jeremy, like, I'm 38. What like, What do you want me to say? You sound like a gay white I'm dude. sorry. Okay. You sound like a gay white I'm, dude. Get the black slang is late. Keep people out of my game room. What should I be saying at 38? Stay out of my business. Damn. Keep you, out my, you thought you was cool. You were saying Keep no. I that's business. just how. That's just literally how I talk. That's, how they, that's what they were saying. That I don't say stay out my business. I just say stay the f out my business. Anyhow, how does it feel like being here? Like, do you feel special? Not really. I feel jet lag. Jet lag. How was your drive? I drove two hours to get here. You know? Good. Good. You don't have to talk in the mic like that. I know this is your I know. Story. Listen, I'm so obsessed. Like, I feel like I want to hold it like this, but it's kind of weird. Like, PG, so. Okay. How are you holding yours? I'm not holding it. We don't even know if it's going to work till, till I get to post uh, production. Hey, that paid and you just wasted our time. You might be mute. You, hey, send somebody out for Starbucks, man. Starbucks, the closest Starbucks to us is uh, 30 minutes away. That's ridiculous. That's so on weekends, we usually take a field trip. Me and Maya will go. You could have, you literally could have bought a house closer to Orlando. I didn't buy a house. Shout out to Trey. I didn't buy a house. I know you. I know you, your husband takes you, you. live a great life. You live a great life. You don't have to really struggle or worry. Your husband takes care of you. I'm gonna let you do that, but the fact that somebody's gonna actually believe you because you sound so for real and passionate is was crazy. Yeah, you do live a great. No, life. my. I do. I love my so life. What are you, so what are you talking about? But you know what I'm... Jeremy swears that I have no issues, no woes. I just wake up to sunny days every day with a money tree that sprinkles and rains on me as I walk past the sunshine. Like, I don't have a perfect life. Yeah, you just, but I love my life. Yeah, yeah, you just say, shout out to Trey. He bought this house. Shut, yeah, because I'm... Listen, I'm going to always give props to Trey. Like, you, he bought the house. Nobody bought me a house. <laughs> okay, okay, well... You live, you live in the lap of luxury. Somebody, oh, somebody broke my Jeremy oh, pulled you. up here with this yellow, yeah, this yellow. Yeah. Oh, okay, then all right, we good. Stand my we, <laughs> that's that's stand, the vibe I want. That's the vibe room. I want. Stay out of my game room. Stay, I'm gonna stay out your game room. I'm gonna mind. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop minding your business. Yeah. But your life is, is good. Yeah. I I appreciate my life. You like you like you like everybody hates Chris like his mom. Um, I don't need this job. My, my, my husband got two jobs. I do feel that way. I know you do. I'm like, uh, how many kids did y'all schedule me this week? Okay, not too much now. Not too much. You got like, f*** this job. I, no, I love, I love where I work. I like, it fits my personality. 
it fits my punctuality, it fits all that. So How? I love my job. How does it fit? Because you're not punctual. Well, I don't have a set schedule. Like I make my own schedule. So that's why I fix your punctuality. Yes, I, I love it. You know what kind of sick person you have to be to bully a twelve-year-old? I never, I never bully. I, I Special never. needs child. I'm always use that because that's always gonna yeah, get. That's what? always gonna almost get you canceled. Guess what? But guess what? That's why. That's why I fuck that you did that. It's that you did that because he's special needs. So he's not. He, so he doesn't even know what he's going through. Jeremy thinks that. Me combining my name and his dad's name together to come up with DeAndre's name is uh, something that's going to just throw him off in life. Listen, like, this is the one thing that's going to throw DeAndre off. It is. Look, look, he got, he, look, what, what's his name? DeAndre. And what's your name? Dion. What's your, what's your husband's name? Rontre. So you took Dion one plus one is two. <laughs> <laughs> what, what? I don't understand what took, the problem is. You took Dion and and Rontre. Rontre was already uphill. That was already if you would if you would have been Rontre Junior. That still would have been like damn. But you would I'd understand like you know. He, he, he. You hitting a lot of birds with this one pebble. Like literally, I feel like there's been many more combinations in the history of anybody we know. None of them were successful. You hear how how confident you are now. But when I brought him in this room to confront you about it, so you could tell him to, to his face that you don't like his name, you caved. Yeah, because you cowered. First of all, he's he's twice my size. He sure is. And he has special needs strength. Hey, what does that exactly mean? What is special needs strength, we all Jeremy? Know I I don't know what you mean. Can you explain it? Yeah, you know, it's, it's the reason why you let him eat chicken nuggets every day. Because you can't tell him no. He has sensory issues. They just like, he just, is that what he told you? Did he he say literally has sensory issues and he has food aversion. Like, I don't feed him chicken nuggets. I'm, I'm not scared of DeAndre. I think you are. I'm definitely not scared of DeAndre. You sure? I'm positive. I, you're scared I of am. DeAndre. Well, and, and you shouldn't be. Because you're trying to say that he has his crazy strength. I'm sure. I'm sure he does. It's I, just that that what you're saying is not even a fact. That is such like. Yeah, that is a fact, Dion. So you're saying what? Say it. What are you saying, Dion? First of all, you you're the best at dancing around. What are you doing the macarena for? Say it. What are you trying to say? You have failed him. What? <laughs> <laughs> you just said that to me. You could have easily called him Leon, <laughs> Dusty. What's your son's name? My son's name is Jahaziel. Oh, you guys got went real Hebrews. Now I can't say anything. Like that's like a cheat code. Well, there you go. <laughs> got it. <laughs> got it. Okay. Got it. My children have cool names. That's okay. Your children have grand <laughs> rising names, and I can't touch that because that community is way bigger than mine. You win. Life comes at you fast. It man. sure does. But when you leave out of here, you better run because I'm for sure gonna let D Man get on you. No, and I, I, and I hope you, I hope you know how to wrestle. People are gonna like me more than they like you. If you could drop a comment right now, let me know. Um, just from face value, just from your good vibes, who do you feel you like better right now? Would it be me? You always have to trust people with glasses now, or would it be? This slick looking. Why you gotta trust you, a, a blind person? Just because you have astigmatism, you're trustworthy? Get the fuck out okay. Of here. Who would you trust more? Would you trust D or would you trust Jeremy? Just just straight off right here. You don't know and you don't know anything about people he's messed over in the past, people he's disrespected, any people he's been the villain in their story. You know nothing. Okay? And, and, Who and, would you trust more? Before you answer that, keep in mind that this lady here named a sweet, innocent, handsome young boy. DeAndre. DeAndre stands for Warrior of Light. It does. Look it up now. It does exactly. Then please don't until you know for That's sure. What made please up don't name, until Dion. you know for sure. Please don't bring it up again. Dion. Warrior of Light. Dion. Warrior of Light. You know what's so important that you made it up on the spot. Like when the baby came out, he's like, "What are you gonna name me?" You said, "Um, Dion Dre. Dion I planned his name. I I literally planned his name. I I planned him. I took my birth control out to have him. Wait a minute, that's entrapment. No, we actually had a conversation. See, y'all used to be entrapped. We had a conversation. Y'all. I'm not saying nothing. You know. Both my children are, are planned. Plan what? Planned. We're gonna have a baby. Then how come you can't understand that I did the same thing? 
Yeah. And thank you. Like I said, yeah. who do you think on face value would be the better person? Like, come on now. Like, well, how do you feel you're any better than me? You have the gift of gab. I have a stuttering problem. That's what you're better at. You're better at s telling stories. You're better at selling lies. But you're not a better person than me. I I'm literally a good person. Oh my gosh, I'm so good. I'm a healer. Yeah, I'm a healer. Those people are. I full attract. Of I attract broken people. Those people are full. Of I'm not full. Of I'm just saying, like, they're good people, by default. That's not by default. I attract up people because I'm a healer. That's. But hey, if, if we if we quiet down, look, you're here. I'm a good person. You're a f***ed up person. No, it's, it's because you it's because you lured me here. How did I be specific? How did I lure you here? You, you, I literally called you with an idea, and you you took my idea, molded it, and made it yours, and then told me I'm gonna be here tomorrow. Be ready. You literally took over my Thursday. Thursday's my Friday night. I'm gonna be watching a movie, eating ice cream, DM. doing TikToks. DM. It's stressful DM. being Jeremy's friend. I don't care how long you've known him, how short you know him, anybody who is his friend, who's at the door? This is interesting. Oh, I don't ever go to the door. I go to my ring camera. Yeah, you got And you know what's funny? They can hear me right now. You gotta wait a second because I gotta get to my app. Oh, it's a package. Oh, what do you know? Your life is so great. You got, you didn't even know you had a package coming. It's probably like a Rolex or or, or a Birkin bag or something. Uh, shit. it's not. Then I'm gonna leave it right what at the it? door. It's the, at the door. Is it Shein uh, outfit? No. Is it called Shein? What is it called? Shein. Shein. I think it's like Jamaican, like Shein. No, you, I think you, it's, you, it's you can't same. miss it. Shein. Yeah, it might be. It's, I think it is. It's cheap. Is that what that is? No, that's not what it is. No, I took it in and I and I and I and I molded it to something. Uh, positive. You haven't said nothing positive this whole time you've been sitting here. Nothing. There's been nothing positive coming from this side of the room. That, so, so I'm gonna give it to you right now. You're very quick on your feet. Your your size five feet. Nine and a half. Five and a half. You're very quick on nine those. And a half. Like like the little troll you are. Tell me what you like about me. Right now, give me my flowers. Yeah, that's not how flowers. Give work. me my flowers. Yeah, you, know, you can't you can't demand positivity. You're trying to force me to do something against my will. That's you see it for yourself. So I want to thank y'all for watching, and I will see you guys. How often should I do like my free birth stuff? Once a month. Once a week. Uh, what? Go up, edit. Andrea, yeah, I'm recording. Okay, bye. Why he busted in here? You almost seemed a little fearful. I swear for a second, I didn't hear you even exhale. No, because, yo, guys, DeAndre is six foot three. DeAndre is five foot six. That's still too tall for somebody. He's a large male.